We now travel to Wine Farm country in the Western Cape and the beautiful Valbedacht estate of rugby legend Skalkberger Sr., who, along with former SA Rugby Federation legend Charles Williams and rugby historian Jaime Sibyl, arranged a rather special reunion of players who had played in the colours of the SA Rugby Football Federation in the pre-transformation era of rugby in this country. Established in the 1960s, the federation was put in place to bring about more unity in the game in South Africa, at a time when rugby unions were divided by race. The federation, which was a established mainly in the Western Cape, has a rich and colourful history, which was celebrated at this special lunch. For many, it was the first time they would all be under one roof after many years. As you can see, it's a, it's a, it's a full house of bringing people from the Federation all over the country. And it's a, it's a big day for them because they, they saw each other uh, in their playing days and that's up to 40 years. And it's a very, very great, great day for us to be involved in this uh, reunion. It's important uh, that uh, they are given the recognition that they deserve, which up to now has not been there. The guys, Scott Berger and these chaps, they were actually emotional, all of them, because, because this is something special. So yes, it's very important. For South African rugby, for the people involved. So it is important, they played a very important part in unity, an important part. For Skulk, it was a trip down memory lane. Those were momentous years with regards to uh, the history of South Africa, just not politically, socio-politically or socio-economically, but within rugby. And um, and it so came that I went to play for the league and, uh, and obviously it, it was a great fill-up for me on and off the field, the, the exceptional camaraderie, the fun, the friendship, um, the, the wonderful games that we played and everything. It, it, it was uh, a part of my life. If I hadn't had it or uh, been through it, I think I would have been a much lesser person today. And today having the first celebration of Federation Rugby uh, on our farm was wonderful. You know, it, it, it was an emotional moment. Uh, and going through the history of it all, it, it was very unique. It's an honour for us that we could introduce the new South Africa through rugby. Our young schoolboy rugby, it was fostered in a way that we were bringing South Africa together. We used rugby to bring the country together. I think the message was said today is um, we mustn't stop where we started now. We must go on with it. And um, the best thing is we must take it back to the community, you see, and start it all over again because this was our pride. Skulk and other white players, including Hempy Stutoy, defied the apartheid laws of the day and played Federation rugby games, playing against some great players of the game to emerge from that union. One of the most beautiful things about playing for the Federation and the League was this most incredible zest for life on and off the field. No matter what their background was, no matter what the political situation was, they taught me a lot about life. But above all, I think the one thing that they taught me as, as a person, you play rugby the way you live your life. But it's been an absolute privilege to have the guys here on our dear farm, Valbedacht, and uh, hopefully, this can become an, an annual event. For Saru, it is important to recognise and acknowledge all facets of our rugby history. You know, today is such a good day for rugby again, as I say. And even for Saru, for that matter, you know, we again divided. And Saru themselves, we in Saru, want to put things together. We want to work in one unit for rugby. And that's important to have more functions like these, organisations like these, to get together so that we can achieve our goal. It's like <laughs> to get together today after all the years is like a celebration. It's like a, a big celebration bringing, seeing our friends and to be together today. It sort of generates a, a new spirit for us to go forward. Gathering together today was fantastic, you know. You share with the guys, you share with the guys memories of 40, 43 years ago. And for me, it was absolutely a remarkable day. And there's hope that there's a beginning of big things to follow.